I stopped working for a paycheck in 2009 and uh, wanted to do something with my time. I had really realized that I um, had been very blessed in my career. I ended up with uh, time on my hands and energy and, and certainly didn't want to uh, go uh, retire, so to speak. I wanted to keep going and I wanted to give back. I happened to go to a, a vision quest in 2011 where the vision came for doing this. And um, I thought, first thought that it was too big. It was too grand an idea that we could get all the elders working together on something. But I, I worked with a shaman who um, helped me uh, realized that yes, we needed to do this, and uh, with some friends, uh, they encouraged that yes, it, it's time to start an, uh, a group of elders with a function of giving back to our community, to our, our to our country. I gathered uh, eleven other comrades to pose the idea in 2013, and. Uh, it was quite an emotional uh, experience, actually. Uh, but anyway, the, the outcome of that was, yes, let's do it. And John, why don't you take the lead? So then thereafter, I um, spent the, the whole year uh, going out, talking about the idea and looking for people who would, would join us in doing this endeavor. And after a year, I uh, rounded up 46 other folks besides myself. And we met in Burlingame, uh, California, in April of 2014, and launched our organization. We didn't have a name at the time. We weren't incorporated at the time. But all that unfolded thereafter. And it was with the idea that elders have lifetimes of experience and, and uh, talent, know-how, uh, resources to work with and who we attract the people have a passion for life and a yearning to give back and they have time. And so that's the group of people that we look for that have that same idea and it has grown from there. We knew right away that it would be national, that it would be people scattered all over and we were pretty uh, early on realizing that we could do a lot of things with Zoom or a similar uh, internet tool. So uh, that was, that was uh, from the get-go. And, and of those 47 people that started it, uh, I probably at least half were from, uh, were from outside of California. So it was built in from the beginning that it would be a national organization. I think what we do is, of course, is, is we, t we have some short courses on how do you use Zoom? And how do you get on to Zoom? How do you set up a meeting? How do you, um, you know, create small groups, how to use chat, all that kind of stuff. And uh, yeah, some people are resistant to it. They don't use the computer particularly, but uh, I would say that uh, as they get used to it, and as they get used to being able to see each other and so forth, they warm up to it and say, geez, I wanna know how to do this. I, you know, this is, this is the greatest thing. And it's kind of like a new version of a, of a telephone. You know, in the old days, they talked about picture phones. Well, we have it now. We, we can help you do this. We'll take you through it step by step. And you'll find that it's once you learn how to do this thing, it's very easy to do. Uh, there's a certain satisfaction that absolutely comes from saying, you know, I'm doing something that's positive here. I'm spending my time and my talent on something that is for the good of the future. And... Um, it, it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it feeds my soul, let's put it that way, to be able.